Do a smuggler playthrough on YouTube, Charlie! Do one! Do one! I don't take orders from anybody. Well, this time, you do. A long time ago, in a galaxy far, far away. Star Wars! Ah, here we go, with another playthrough. Prologue, The Smuggler. Anarchy rules in the frontier systems. While the Galactic Republic struggles to recover from its conflict with the Sith Empire, reckless mercenaries profit from the interstellar turmoil. Ord Mantel, a world ravaged by civil war between pro-Republic citizens and separatist extremists, has become a lucrative destination for free traders. Now, a daring captain for hire has come to deliver a cargo of weapons to the combat zone, flying a swift freighter through a deadly barrage of separatist attacks. Dot 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 dot. Finally, doing the smuggler. A proper playthrough, not a Twitch playthrough, because remember what happened with a Twitch playthrough? I kind of just stopped. So I'm going to do this on YouTube. Yay! I kind of wish I could skip the crawl and just get straight to the panning down to the planet, but unfortunately not. You've got to watch the crawl and then it pans down, because if you skip one, you skip it all. I'm going to read my emails. I've got emails on my phone while it does the thingy. Um, nothing of interest. Nothing of interest. Alright. I'm being attacked! Oh no! Ha ha! Or should I do it, should I do it as like, um... Like, um... I forgot that get I forgot the name of the bully from The Simpsons. Oh my god, I've forgotten the name of the bully from The Simpsons. The one that goes, ha ha Um Oh my god, I've forgotten. I'll press spacebar, but I do need to do one thing first. Escape, 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 escape. Okay, we're there. Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. And let me put that on. Oh yeah, it's the smuggler in the blind. I need to walk over there. Because I thought I thought to myself, well, smugglers are a bit unpredictable sometimes. So, how about we do that with the smuggler as well? So if you remember my trooper in the blind, what that was is that I'd play the trooper, and then in conversations. I would press one, two, or three, and then we'd see what happens. Just, just see what happens. You know, just see the carnage that it's used. It could be light side. It could be dark side. It could be anything. And I thought I'd do it again with the smuggler. And smugglers are unpredictable, and they are chaotic. And this will be fun. Let's go. So, I mean, I don't know who you are. He just so happens to look like old Han Solo. Wasn't intended. Yeah, it just happened. That separatist shooting gallery, Captain. Your ship isn't even scratched. It takes guts landing in the middle of a battlefield. Nice flying. Oh, I thank you very much. Somebody want to explain what's going on? Separatists are invading this village, attacking everyone who wasn't one of them. My name's Skavik. I'm picking up those blasters in your cargo hold. Excuse the rush, but uh, need to get out of here quick. This village used to be safe, but the Separatists are taking over. If I were you, I'd haul jets as soon as we're done. Who are these people? What are they after? Separatists want to break away from the Republic. <laughs> Judging from all the explosions, they're serious about the idea. 
Sounds like the bombing's getting closer. The Separatists will be right on top of us any minute. Here's your payment for making this run, Captain. As soon as I have those blasters, you'll be free to fly. Skavik, we've got a big problem. Separatists took over the local air defense cannon. Oh, slow down. Slow down, Corso. What are you talking about? They deployed some kind of remote control stations, hijacked the cannon's targeting computer. Damn Separatists just destroyed an incoming Republic transport. It always bothers me how Corso is echoed because of the sound of the room, and Skarvik isn't. What's the big deal? Don't you get it? The Separatists can attack any starship coming in or out of here. With those remote control stations, the Separatists can override the air defense cannon's computer, turn that firepower against us any time they want. That's bad news, Captain. The Separatists will blast you out of the sky even if you think about taking off. The Separatists have remote control stations all over the area. You'll probably have to hit several before they lose control of that cannon. I heard explosions. I should charge extra for my thrilling heroics. Good luck. Hope we see you again. Let's move, Corso. We're running out of time. Destroy the remote control stations. Alright, that's fine. Now, like I said in my Sith Inquisitor playthrough, if you haven't started watching that, the Smuggler will be every Tuesday and Thursday. Whether or not that I'll keep to that, I don't know. I really don't know. You know what I'm like. I most likely won't. But I will try my damn hardest. Where's my Shadow of Reverend rewards? Uh, Rise of the Hot Cartel. No, not that one. Um. Uh. Uh. The. 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 Okay, I can't find it. This one! That's the one I want. I want that. Thank you. I can't be bothered with the rest of the stuff. Because. I don't need to. And remember as well, it will only be the main missions that I'm doing. I won't be doing any of the side missions because it's not really needed. It really isn't. That's that one done. Blow this one up. And one more to blow up. Which would be... How about you? Yeah, I'll blow you up. Why the hell not? Uh, disable the targeting computer, which is in there. This is going to be a very, very, very easy mission. Oh, if the area doesn't get in my way. Uh, up the stairs. Anyone up here? I'm going to kill you. Okay, there's not. We're fine. When in doubt, just blow it up. Captain, you there? It's Corso. We got trouble back at the hangar. Oh, of course we do. Is there a reason you're whining to me about it? You got a blaster? Figure it out. Separatists are busting into the hangar. We're giving them a warm welcome, but we could use a hand. Skavik, get over here. Help me seal this hangar door. Skavik, what are you... Uh-oh. What's going on with Skavik? I wonder what it could be. But I think it's pretty obvious, don't you? I'm sorry if my voice sounds a bit croaky this episode. I had like an ice cream before I started recording and it had sherbet on it. And the sherbet went down the wrong way and I kind of lost my voice for like two minutes. Where I was like, oh, hello, hello. So I, I'm all better now, but oh, that was horrible. I have lost my voice before and it is, it is not pleasant in the slightest. Oh yeah, of course I can do the duck down thing, can't I? Of course. Charge burst. You're dead. And you're dead too. Corso! Oh no, Corso! Are you okay? Uh, feels like a gun dark used my skull as a drum. Thanks for saving my hide, Captain. My ship! To be fair though, my character shouldn't have left the keys on that. Skavik helped those separatists get in here. He stabbed us in the back. I just got here. Bring me up to speed. Last thing I remember was Skavik sucker punching me. Looks like he and his separatist buddy stole everything. Hang on. Where's Torchy? I don't believe this. Skavik stole my blaster. Torchy's a genuine blast tech, all 25 with magnetomic adhesion grip and side-mounted rangefinder. She's too good for Skavik. Yep, I understood every word of that. Forget your stupid blaster. What about my ship? He's not getting away with this. Come on. Come on, pick up, blast you. Oh, what's the matter, Corso? Did I hurt your feelings? Be thankful you're alive, kid. Do 
Do you have any idea who you're messing with? What makes you think I care? On behalf of Lord Mantel's glorious freedom fighters, I thank you for your blasters, your ship, and a big laugh. Have a nice day. Don't be stupid. You can't win. It's no use. He cut the comm channel. He always was good at making an exit. Skavik stole my best blaster, but I guess it's not as bad as losing a whole starship. I feel for you, Captain. You better feel for Listen, me. Skavik and I were working for a guy named Vito. When he finds out Skavik's a separatist, he'll want revenge just like you. Do yourself a favor and go talk to Vito in Fort Garnick. I guarantee he'll help get your ship back. Yeah, forts tend to be full of people I prefer to avoid, kid. Not to worry. The Republic Army runs Fort Garnick, but they let the boss do as he pleases. He keeps their supply lines open. Vito's a smart guy with connections everywhere. If anybody can find your ship, it's him. I have to lock down this hangar, but I'll send Vito a hollow and tell him what's up. Fort Garnick isn't far from here. I'll see you and Vito there soon, Captain. Will you tell him that the sky's up? Because that is true. Everybody with me now who watches my stream! V do V do V do V Just just me? Alright then. And give me my buffs. Thank you very much. Oh god, I got hiccups now. Don't you just hate it when you've had a lovely, lovely ice cream and you've now got the hiccups? I hate it all the time. You separatists think you could take me on? Think again. Charge burst! Wow, that was a lot of damage for uh one shot. Well then. Uh, right, who are we speaking to? It's not you. You're not Vidu. You're Twitter. You're the main mission of the area. Ooh, there's something I can pick up. I go over here. What new abilities have you got for me? Even though I could just look at Dr. Ogrom. But never mind, eh? Thank you. Blaster Whip. Strikes the target with your weapon for 120 under 138 kinetic damage. Thank you very much. Abby Dopey. Yes, I understood exactly what you said there. I speak Rodian. I speak Rodian. True story. See, I speak Rodian. That was, hello, my name is Charlie Murray. Yeah, you, you totally believe me, don't you? Yeah, I, I, I am. I, 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 I also know Wookiee. See? I'm amazing. Hi, Vidu. Welcome, Captain. I'm Vidu. Corso told me we've had a rough day. How about a drink to wash away our worries? Here's a toast to my favorite things. The best collection of artworks and exotic beverages in the whole system. And here's to the stupid separatists who destroyed it all. Between them and that backstabber Skavik, I am thoroughly ruined. The blasters Skavik stole in your ship belong to Rogan the Butcher. As employers go, he's not the most forgiving. That's a tough break. I'm sorry. Feel sorry for yourself. I'm working for him, but you're working for me. He'll blame us equally for this mess. He's killed enough people to fill a convoy of bulk freighters, and now we've crossed him. Rogan bought those blasters to protect his business from separatists. When he finds out what's happened, guess who dies first? You? The only way we're getting out of this alive is finding Skavik, your ship, and those stolen blasters. I've got an idea of where to start looking for Skavik. There's a guy named Reiki who's an expert on separatists. Problem is, Reiki's stuck behind a Republic blockade. Troops have his village surrounded while they contain the Separatists there. There must be somebody else with knowledge of the Separatists. Reiki's the only person I trust to give us solid information. I'm friendly with the Republic commander in charge of the blockade. I can get you in and out of the village. But you'll have to earn that free pass by taking out a few Separatists to prove your loyalty. You up for that? I did that on the way here. I'd kill those scum just for kicks. Good. One less detail to worry about. Riki's village is running out of basic supplies thanks to the Republic blockade. Things are getting desperate in there. I'll pull together a survival kit. You smuggle it to Reiki, and he'll tell you a way to find Skavik. Riki's at a hideout in Talaran Village. I'll send a message so he knows you're coming. What are we going to say? Dalaran Village, then? It sounded very similar. I should probably also mention as well, if you want to do a character in the blind, whether it be a warrior, a smuggler... A trooper, Imperial Agent, whatever it is, probably not Imperial Agent, but whatever, then all you need to do is go into your interfa interfa the, the interface editor, go to conversation, and then you would normally have the um, 
the response wheel here. It would normally be here. Scale it down to 0 0.25, put the alpha down to 0%, and then put it in one of the corners here. So that way you'll be able to see it pop up in the corner. You can still see it. You'll still see it pop up in the corner. But then when it pops up, you'll know you need to press either 1, 2, or 3. Simple. It generally only works for like main ma main missions. Um, because any other side missions and all that, there is like the possibility sometimes to quit out of the mission. Um, so if you're going to try it with that as well, be a little careful. Be a little bit careful. But you can do it with that as well. Uh, but this is mainly for the main mission, which I'm doing now. Squeaky voice again. I have a squeaky voice every now and then. It really annoys me. Level 4. Let's see what new abilities we got. Dirty kick. Is it a pooey kick or a muddy kick? It's a dirty kick. Oh my god, go away. Although, Separatist, yay, bonus mission, I think. No? no? Oh, I was going to say, bonus mission. Oh no, this is the actual mission. Oh, right. Alright, fine, yeah, I'll kill ya. I really should, um... Oh, I'm already in cover. Oh, some sort of cover. I should probably have that as like my first ability. Yeah, move that there, so then that way I go straight into cover. There we go, find Reiki safe house. Uh, found it! That was easy! Reiki! Or Reki. How do you say your name? I have no idea. I wish I could stealth. Really wish I could stealth. Oh no! Oh no! I thought you were going to see me then. Fortunately not. It's just that one guy. You're certainly not a resident here. And you're no separatist. You must be that hotshot freighter Captain Vidu described over the holo. Hot shot? These poor, starving ladies and I are very grateful for the supplies you've brought. If I wasn't so exhausted, I'd throw you a party. That poor, starving, invisible lady. How about a little something extra for all my hard work? Fine, fine. I'm too tired to argue with you. I'll arrange for some credits to be transferred into your account. Thank you. Vidu said you're seeking information on a particular separatist named Skavak. The only place to find personnel data like that is at Manit Point. I used to... Acquire quality goods at a discount on Man at Point. And then you took an hour. I discovered all manner of shortcuts through the island's warehouses. And then you took an hour. I to kept the detailed schematics of every maintenance passage and tunnel there. And then you took an hour. Unfortunately, to I had to abandon those schematics when I fled Man at Point. And then you took an hour. It actually doesn't work very well. That you got a brilliant plan, right? I always have a brilliant plan. That's why I'm still alive. Still alive. My schematics are still in my former home. However, I short-circuited the building's door and sealed it shut when I left. The only way to reopen the door is by disrupting Manit Point's power relays. Once you gain entry, you'll find my schematics cleverly disguised as an extraordinarily tedious treatise on bird watching. Don't worry, I'll teach you the code I use to conceal my schematics. You won't die of boredom reading about rare waterfowl. Now pay attention and listen carefully, because you really don't want to hear this twice. Blah 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 blah. And replace every mention of the Mantellian flutter plume with the number three. Did you get all that? That is the most sadistic way to hide information I have ever heard. Then you clearly haven't lived enough. Once you read my schematics, the way into the Separatist computer station will become clear. Unfortunately, that only solves half your problems. The Separatists encrypt all their files. You'll need special equipment to decipher their data. That's Vidu's area of expertise, not mine. I'll uh, take those supplies now, if you don't mind. These poor ladies could use some cheering up. It's disgusting how you take advantage of these women. Don't be so quick to judge. These ladies adore me for a reason. I can barely see her. Enjoy your bonus with my compliments. It should arrive in your account shortly. Farewell, Captain. All I saw was a leg. He's saying that one leg is a lady. Well, these days you never know. Hello, Vidu. I am back. You must be the freighter Captain Vidu's expecting. It's a pleasure to meet you in person. I'm Sirena. Hi. What's a knockout like you doing in this dump? I'm here to enhance the aesthetics of Vidu's surroundings. He enjoys looking at pretty things while he works. I heard about what happened with Skavik. Can't say I'm surprised. I told Vidu not to trust that scoundrel. Vidu's putting on a brave face for me, but I can tell he's terrified. Is it bad? Should I be worried? You don't really expect me to answer that, do you? If something bad is about to happen, I'd like to be as far away from it as possible. A little warning is all I ask. I suppose I shouldn't keep you any longer. Vidu might get the wrong idea about us. 
If he's going to suspect anyway. I forgot I was the true. Uh, <laughs> I was in the blind I man. I can see you are going to be trouble. We'll have to continue this discussion later. Farewell, Captain. Should have done a swanky walk away. You know, just a tease. Har Harlow. That's how I say his name. Harlow is how you say his name. If you are wondering, Harlow. Like already, Captain. Uh, help me and Corso finish this robe of steak. Don't let this fine cut of meat go to waste. Boss, quit acting like it's your last meal. Rogue and the Butcher isn't gonna kill you. I won't blow this, trust me. Until I've recovered those stolen blasters, I'll eat and drink like there's no tomorrow. I hear things went well for you in Talaran. It takes nerve to squeeze credits out of starving people. Ricky told me he gave you a way into the Separatist hideout. Said something about a secret entrance? I always wondered how Ricky could steal so much from Man at Point and not get caught. Getting into Man at Point will be extra tricky. For one thing, you have to swim there. Lies! When the Separatists invaded, they blew up the only bridge leading onto the island. Turned it into their private resort. You'll be walking into the Rankers' Den, Captain. There is no swimming in Swotor, don't you know this? I'll do it blindfolded, just for fun. What are you doing a playthrough blindfolded? Cocky. That place is crawling with people who'd like to blast that grin off your face. If you download the Separatist computer files onto this datapad and bring it back here, we'll handle the rest. I'd rather go with you, Captain. My Vira Blade's pretty good for chopping Separatists off at the knees. I call it Huey. Why do you give everything names? Forget about the Separatist, Corso. I want that slicer kit here before the Captain comes back. I'm on it, boss. Good luck at Man at Point, Captain. Last thing I need is Corso turning one-man army out there. Kid'll just get himself killed for nothing. Separatists wiped out his family a couple of years ago. Corso took it personal. I bet he cries himself to sleep every night. I wouldn't say that to his face if I were you. For a light-hearted guy, Corso takes his family very seriously. Vidu, there's someone named Rogan calling on the Holo. He sounds upset. Uh-oh. Oh, that's all I need. Uh, stall him for me, sweetheart. Remember the plan. Disrupt Man at Point's power relays, get inside Reiki's old home, and use those schematics to enter the Separatist base. When you're in, slice into the Separatist computer and download everything onto my datapad. Good luck. That should be easy, surely. Ooh, something for me. Lovely. Can I take that as well? Yeah, might as, I might as well take this, because... Oh, not like this. this not that. Um, ooh, XP boost. Yeah, I'll take that as well. Um, should we do one more mission before we finish up? I think we shall, because, of course, the, 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 the episode could get very long. Or very short, I should say. Um, if I don't do too much. Um... Because, yeah. A smuggler is the last class I need to do before I get that mark as well. The mark that he's got. No, let me, let me cluck on, let me cluck on you. That. Okay, fine. Won't show people it. Nope, you've ruined it for everybody. I mean the legendary status mark. The smuggler is the only class I need to do before I get that. So I'm kind of excited. You are cleared for the following travel routes. Although it really doesn't matter. It's just one slightly... Incy wincy icon that just doesn't mean anything. Just means that you've done all the class stories. Hooray! So, eh. I just realized as well. Harlow. Ha, which is Harrison. And then, low, Han Solo. Low, 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 solo. I, d I, just, I just realized that. It's, that's, that is the most cutest thing I ever came up with, subconsciously. I know, I know, right? Wait, why am I going that way? Oh, I need to go that way anyway. I was going to say, why am I going this way? I need to get something from over there, but it's over there, over there. Thanks, man. Not that I needed your help, but thank you very much anyway. No, I'm getting to this first. I'm going to ruin your day. Oh, you're a trooper anyway. You don't need that. Can I just ask, is there anybody here that has actually ever done a character in the blind? Am I the only one in all of Swotor that's ever done it? Has anyone ever done like a troop in the blind or warrior in the blind or anything like that? Are you going to do one after this playthrough or after my trooper playthrough if, you've, if you're going to watch, start watching that as well? Have you ever thought about doing one? Try it. It is. It can be pretty fun. It can be hilarious sometimes. There were some hilarity moments with uh, the trooper. There were some contradictory moments if you want to go and watch that playthrough. There were some things that just made no sense whatsoever, but whatever. Well, I mean, they made sense to a certain point of view. But, that sound, sound like Obi-Wan then. But, you know, my trooper would backtrack on it on himself and nobody would say a thing because characters only say a certain amount of things because they're 
voice that way. You know, they can't voice say, you contradicted yourself. Because they didn't add that into the game. Because why would they? And the last one. Thank you. Can I go in here now? I can. Find Reki's treatise on bird watching. Oh, joy. I shall come through here. Locked. Oh. Okay, then. Uh, bird watching, bird watching, bird watching. There it is. You open Reki's treatise on Ord Man's house, exotic birds, and are instantly bored by the dull tech sentries. I became starship captain so I wouldn't have to do homework. You quickly use a cipher Reki taught you to uncover the schematics hidden within the text. The schematics show you a door in Reki's basement that opens to an area outside the perimeter walls. The pathway leads down the hill to the maintenance passage leading into the Separatist hideout lower level. The Separatist computer station is under heavy guard, but they won't expect attackers coming from the back door. Well then. They're going to get a nasty surprise when I come in through the back door. Hi, Seps. You weren't expecting me, were you? I mean, sure, you could go tell everybody now that I'm here, but but that's not going to help because I'm going to kill you all anyway. Yeah, and I'm going to give you a dirty kick. Dirty kick. <laughs> right in the balls. Hope that was painful before you died. Access the Separatist computer. Why am I pressing the wrong one? Which is down there. What? Oh my god, go away! Ooh, something blue. Uh, ah, companion gift. Alright. Oh, Not that I have a companion right now. And I don't think my first companion would even want jewelry anyway. Because I know what my first companion is. Do you? I've only got four more I need to kill for the bonus mission. So I might as well kill these guys over here. And then I'll probably end up killing one more because there'll probably be one more in my way anyway. Because that's always how it works. Alright, what do I need to access? Um, terminal. Ah, this terminal. But I'll kill you in the meantime. Give me my bonus mission, please. Thank you. Level 6. Oh, yes. We've got any new abilities? I do. A flash grenade and vital shot. I'll put my flash grenade down here. Nope, down, down, down. Oh, I've locked, I've locked it. Oops. Down here. Move that over there. All right. Let's do this. Come on, Force, and say it just like I taught you. The Republic lackeys will drown in lakes of fire and blood, Master. Death to all who oppose the people's will, Master. Hey there. Uh, we had some trouble with the power relays. I need to check on the computer core. You mind? Master. I detect the presence of several non-functioning humans, specifically the bodies over there. Setting alert status red. <gasps> this is about to get real ugly for you. Oh, we're doing dark side, are we? Oh. Force an open fire! Combat protocols activated. I remember there was a, um, a piece of text where I could be like, Oh no! Those dead bodies! Or something along those lines. Uh, I was hoping to press that one, but I couldn't remember which, which that one that was, so... Oh well, never mind. We're done now anyway. Return to Rendia Freight, who is uh, all the way over in... Oh! Over there. Oh, we need to go over there anyway. Oh, right. I'm back, baby. Where's my parade? Leave me alone, Bracco. If Vito knew about this, he'd... Vito? That blob can't even protect himself. It's only a matter of time before the rogue on the butcher punches your fat meal ticket for good. You better start thinking about the future, girl. When Vito is gone, you'll need new friends. Captain, thank goodness. I could use your help here. There's nothing wrong with you, scum. A good thrashing won't fix. You just picked a fight with the wrong bunch of guys, pal. Any last words? <laughs> Never mind. We don't care. I mean. I would give you last words. I mean, they would have your last words, unfortunately. But, you know, you asked for it. Oh, fine. There we go. One more. You. You might just run away. All right, don't run away then. Fine. Fine. You killed them all. For me. Thank you, Captain. I don't know what else to say. Relax. Everything's going to be all right. If there's any way I can repay you. I will. What Bracco said was true. Rogue and the Butcher will kill Vito if those blasters don't turn up. 
Vidu can't protect me anymore. He's not half the man you are. Uh -huh -huh. After this, you're on your own. But you've already done so much. I know somewhere deep down you care about me. I should go. Vidu's waiting for you. I won't forget your kindness, Captain. Farewell for now. Your teeth! They're weird! However, Vidu is going to have to wait for me. So we will speak to him in the next episode, which you can expect on Thursday. So thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen, and I will see you next time. And a farewell, droid, to you.